Hey y'all, I'm back. No lashes, greasy hair, and I'm about to empty out my Nespresso machine. I got one for Christmas that I bought myself, and I'm going to empty out my pods and review the ones that I've tried so far. Here's my Nespresso baby. Uh, she's pretty. She's white, and look at my little station that I have going down. Mine the fork scissor from my husband's birthday thing this weekend. But, and that's my husband's coffee, but we have a, like, legitimate coffee station going here. First thing we're going to do is empty the one from this morning, and then we're going to go over all of these. All right, first up, caramel cookie. This is a uh, coffee. Um, I hated it. Absolutely disgusting. Really upset that I bought 10 of these. It was so gross. It was super, super bitter. Uh, like, two out of 10. Starbucks blonde single espresso. Um. Uh, amazing um now well okay it's not amazing it's good it'll work i use it uh pretty often uh it's all right um it'll work it's a good base for your lattes and such next up we have another coffee we have vanilla custard pie now i do love these little coffee ones they're so cute but this one was super bitter too um don't know if I just didn't put enough creamer in that one or something. I probably need to revisit that one because the latte in general I made that day, which I guess it wouldn't be a latte because it wasn't espresso. It would just be coffee. But the coffee I made that day wasn't very good. Next, we have Double Dolce Espresso. Uh, second favorite so far. I really like this one. I'm glad I bought 10 of these. This is kind of the one that I've been going to. Um, I was using the Starbucks ones when I didn't have Double Dolce. Next up is another coffee. It is the Melozio. Lucio, uh, it looks like that. Um, it was okay. It was just, it tasted like regular coffee. Another Starbucks blonde espresso. Another Starbucks blonde espresso. Uh, next, this is definitely one that my husband tried. Um, Il Cafe espresso, uh, dark blue, almost black. Um, couldn't tell you. Uh, my husband tried it. Uh, it smells super fucking strong though, so it's probably not for me. Last but no, most certainly not least, this one was my favorite. This is the Bianca Legaro. Uh, I absolutely loved this one. I think this is a espresso that's made for milk. Uh, it's not a coffee. But this one was super, super good. And I wanted to order this one. This was the very first one I tried that came in my sample pack. It is not on the Nespresso site. And I can't find it anywhere but Amazon for like $50 for 10 And I'm not doing that. So that is all the ones that I tried. Now I'm going to go over a couple more that I have in my little canister here that I want to try. Here's my little canister of pods. Got this from Aldi like a year ago. This is one of the holiday coffees. This is gingerbread. I decided to try this one even though I'm out of my gingerbread creamer. Purple espresso. Don't even know which one this one is. Why do they sell decaf espresso? Why is that a thing? And finally, Stormio. That's all.